And I would like to present clinical features in pain. And the next, uh, in pain in Poland. Uh, patients, uh, I group, uh, my group of patients with the MPAN born is 1979 and 26, uh, 2006 is 45 patient life 36 and boys is aggregate 40, 28 and girls only 14. Age of diagnosis of this, uh, my children was 4, 4 and 14 years, meaning 10 years. First symptoms in all my patient was gay dis disorders. An MRI, when we use this uh, imagination, imagine, we saw hypointense signal in T2 in globus pallidus and uh, substantia nigra. We found the pathogenic mutation uh, C19 of 12, all found in Munich, first at uh, 2011 by Arkana, Arkangela Yuzo, Thomas Meitinger, Monica Harting, and all team of this uh, center of genetic diagnosis. Uh, what's the result of molecular DNA tests of C9, uh, 9 or 12? Main mutation, it's uh, we uh, found in my patient, in 30 patient was C204 and 214 del deletion. Other mutation was the heterozygote mutation with uh, other like you see on below of these uh, slides. What is the main clinical features in impan? Is progressive dispersion of gait in 100 patients, hyperreflexia uh, in 19 uh, per, uh, percent of patients, the aculus tendus contracture. We observe on all patients club feet with a hammer too, and we observe in half of patient decrease of cognitive, cognitive function, and uh, in most patients. In more patients, we observed optical nerve atrophy with low visual acuity. And after, during this progress of disease, we observed the axonal motor neuropathy with muscle atrophy in 70%. Speech disorders, slow, silent, and dysartia was observed in 80%. And loss of gait in 100%. Mm, patients, person patients after the uh, 18 years of life. What's the gait disturbances? We observed the spastic paraparesis of legs, clap feet, contractures of feet tendons are the most motor sim symptoms for all implant adolescence and over time affects this body region and typically worsens the normal earlier gait. Spasticity of uh, Achilles tendons, we use the treatment, baclofen, cellular, medical, clonazepam, without effects, and rigidity of Achilles tendons was progress. Contractures of uh, Achilles tendons, the club feet, orthopedic shows, probably we used to help this patient and some operation treatment of short tendons and feet. And we used sometimes botulin toxin, but this only we have transient improvement. Disease is still progressive. And gait disturbances and spastic paraparesis of legs and this maintenance of range of motion in all joints facilitate optimal functions, maintain good posture, promote ablation for long as possible, and minimize the development of fixed deformities and secondary complications of contractures. The, the very important uh, clinical features in this patient yes, is uh, the optical nerve atrophy uh, with the low visual acuity in 90% of patients. We observe progressive visual impairment, is, which is very common in old adolescents and adult infant patients. Some adolescents manifest poor vision in low light conditions with decreased acuity of vision, which may contribute to falls. We use the vision above potential and Snellen test detected early low acuity of vision and partial or total atrophy optical nerves, still progressive. The next clinical feature is speech and language and communication. 
Uh, the older adolescents with impen have delayed, slow, silent, weak, understable speech and later with dysarthria, hypophonia with progressive disabilities. Therapy speech with use of argumentative communication devices are valuable. But visual difficulties not led to use hand typing devices in older patients or prolonged leave of function. And the other clinical feature in this, my patient was the psychiatric and behavioral disorders. Young adolescents with implant have uh, impulsivity, obsessive compulsive disorders, emotional lability, ADHD like syndrome, anxiety, depression, and all need inclusion of a psychiatrist. Neuroleptics are useful, but sometimes may aggravate dysarthria and dysphagia. And the dementia, we observe in the 14, 15 years of life in these children, is degrees of congenitive function, it progressive disharmonious development of cognitive function and intelligence quality level below the low references quality level in 40% adolescents in psychological evaluation I observed. And vocal scale was better than the manual scale. It was the devastating all the motor system in this patient was axonal motor neuropathy after above uh, 15 years. We observed the progressive axonal motor neuropathy with atrophy on hands, muscle of hands, legs, muscle, and weakness of muscle ox extremities during six, five years from onset of disease. NCE, uh, neural conduction speeds, slight decrease amplitude, millivolt, and prolonged latency onset at 11, 13 years of life, and still progressive. And the other, like Parkinsonian and stiffness uh, uh, features, I usually contribute, observe, and usually contribute slightly significantly to disability as disease advances. And motor axonal neuropathy, atrophy, optical nerves, dysarthria, dysphagia move a significant impact of quality of life. And this Parkinsonia of MPAM is relatively symmetric, usually with significant postural instability, weakness of muscle, radicinesia, and rigidity. And uh, affected, we observe also in affected siblings are phenotypically concordant with, uh, and their diseases advances at similar rate. The clinical exam is most useful in gauging progression and gauging ongoing management. Treatment, as you know, we use the medication iron chelating agent deferiprone, newer chelators agents more readily cross the blood barrier barrier, yet have a lower affinity for iron, thereby minimize systemic iron loss. But deferoprone is in new data support is effectiveness in lowering brain iron levels as measured by MRI, but convincing evidence of clinical benefits is lacking. And in summary, main common devastating symptoms of the central peripheral nervous system in infant is pyramidal signs, dementia, optical nerve atrophy, axonal motor neuropathy, speech disorders, loss of gait, after the 18 years of life and Parkinsonian. Summary is, is many neurodegenerative disorders, movement symptoms in pain are often mixed with neuropathy, Parkinsonism, visual nerve atrophy, dysarthria, dysphagia, dementia, stiffness and spasticity resistor are managed with the anticholinergy in benzodiazepines, antispasticity agents, or in combination as symptoms indicate. We do not have any effective medication in the impan progression and we can use symptomatic treatment. The main goal of treatment is relief of the most devastating symptoms with the aim to minimize both disability and of target effects as much as possible. Thank you for your attention and we are my acceleration efforts in seeing to mitochondrial membrane protein in impan. Thank you for this um, very interesting. Sorry for my English and for my exciting during this presentation. You've just done very fine. Thank you very much. The uh, question and open session is open. Please submit your questions. We have 83 people watching. 
do feel free. I wonder, um, when you look at the parents of these children, do you see any um, late onset neurodegeneration, which may be more common than in the general no, population? No, but if these uh, uh, parents of these children, not all, are characteristic. It's not very good in uh, uh, school effects. Uh, and uh, they are all are loudly and uh, uh, fast in, per, in, in action during the life uh, uh, during the life and uh, during the talk with them. I observed loudly, speedily speak during. They haven't um, but I have any uh, other uh, neurological symptoms in this patient. They have a loud speech? Is that what you're saying? It's loudly, actually, very loudly. Loudly very, speech. Very loudly. Okay. Most speech and have a bad attention and what's more, what's more, um, not good effects in the uh, school. Have you formally have, uh, The parents have not um, very uh, good uh, uh, effects in education, I suppose. Have, have you My, formally test this? Have you done a study to test these parents? No, 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 I don't test these parents. Any other questions? With regards to the Parkinsonism, have you done that scan? Is that something that you do? No, I no perform because we have an impossibility. Maybe in the future we have, during two years, we have no possibility to use that scan and maybe I can use this. And treatment-wise, do you treat them with dopaminergic therapy? No, it's without effect. It's without effect, okay. How, what's your experience with regards to deep brain stimulation? Is that something that has been no, done? In, in this, no, I didn't use in this patient anymore any uh, DBS, only in PICAN. Thank you. Any other questions from the audience? Somebody that says thank you for the wonderful talk. Anything else? If there's no further questions, thank you very much for presenting. Thank you very much.